All right. So when stripping out your glass, I'm going to let you listen to this. Okay. You know what that is? It's like a broken record, but it's exactly how your glass cover has to sound when you're stripping out glass. Okay. Now you can't take off this little bit, this little bit right here with your running pliers because it's not going to work. Okay. So keep in mind, and I've said this umpteen times for you, when you are stripping glass or cutting straight lines, you pull the glass cutter to you. When you're cutting patterns, and I've got a little thing drawn on this, you push your glass cutter. Otherwise, you can't see what you're doing. And a lot of you have enough trouble cutting glass. You have enough trouble cutting glass without not being able to see what you're doing, okay? So think about that. You can cut your glass just like that, okay? Looks, Looks like, like a crab claw. <laughs> so just take your time. Make, Make sure your glass cutter is oiled, your glass is clean, and your tools are all working the way they're supposed to. Because once again, ladies and gentlemen, this square is one of the most important tools in your toolbox. It's right up there with your glass cutter. Because without your glass cutter, without your square, you can't cut a straight line free-handed. Thanks again for tuning in to Glass Chat tonight. I hope everybody enjoyed it. It's just a simple thing, but let me tell you, without this square in your toolbox, you're missing. So what we've created here is a, is a half moon. I'm going to run it part of the way. Okay, and I'll come, come back, back over here and I'll run it back the other direction. Okay. And that just comes right out. Does that look real easy? Well, sometimes you make things look easy that are difficult, but the only reason you do, the only way you can do that is by practice, Barb. Okay. So if I wanted to come up in here and I wanted to, I wanted to get up in here and take this little bit here out. Now it's a little going to be a little bit more difficult, but because this is spectrum or ocean side, this will come right out too. Okay. Oh, nice. So sometimes, sometimes you have to rock it back and forth. Okay. Sometimes you have to rock it back and forth in order to remove these pieces, okay? So just remember, if you're practicing cutting glass, cut glass on window glass, eighth inch window clear window pane glass is the best to practice on. When you feel confident enough in your glass cutting to move on to colored glass, colored sheet glass, then go ahead and do so. But remember, if they're textured, you don't have to push as hard, but you have to have that sound from beginning to end of that wheel rolling across that sheet of glass, separating the molecules so that it'll break correctly for you. Right. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Happy and New Year. Happy New Year. And we will see you. We'll oh. see you on a pre recorded live stream. On the road with on, RDRV on, on next the road. week. And we'll see you soon. Thank you for watching. Good night, everybody. Good night. See you later. Bye bye.